We cannot forget these children that have died from gun violence, whether it's gun violence from a homicide, unintentional shooting uh, in the home, or suicide. Remembering children who have lost their lives to gun violence. That's the mission of an art exhibit on IUPUI's campus. Good evening, everyone. I'm Phil Sanchez. And I'm Alexis Rogers. News 8 Sierra Hignite joins us now with more on the impact that the curators of Faces Not Forgotten are hoping to leave behind. Sierra. The exhibit features portraits of people ages 21 and younger whose lives were lost as a result of gun violence. Multiple states are featured in the exhibit, including Indiana. Now, all of the children shown in the Indiana series are from the same city crippled by gun violence. The walls of the Cultural Art Gallery at IUPUI are covered in the faces of young people who have died because of gun violence. We know that the statistics are there. We are losing eight children in that age group every single day to gun violence. On the center wall, eight portraits of faces from Indianapolis, a city on track to break yet another homicide record. You become immune to it. It's just another morning report, like the traffic report. The Faces Not Forgotten exhibit hopes to continue the legacy of the people behind the portraits. It gives faces to the names. It makes real people out of numbers. We have to get past the head count. And we have to look at the people, the individuals, the children, and all of the people they leave behind whose lives are devastated forever. Pastor Jackie Jackson with Every Town for Gun Safety knows all too well the impact gun violence can have on a person. I was shot at 10 years old um, by a trusted neighbor. My oldest son was shot 37 years later in the back with a shotgun and he lived. He wants to prevent families from going through what his has. I've seen what it does to families the, right there when it first happens and later on down the road. People behind the exhibit hope that when you see these faces, you're reminded of the innocent lives taken simply for being at the wrong place at the wrong time. These lives, each one is a life, a single individual, and you hear the numbers and you can't quite put your head around numbers. So as an artist, my job is to tell that story. And Faces Not Forgotten has done more than 300 portraits honoring victims throughout the country. Today was the last day for the exhibit at IUPUI, but we have linked where you can see more of their work or submit a photo of a young victim on our website. Just click on this story in the As Seen on Wish TV section. Reporting, I'm Sierra Hignite, Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook.